Hi, everyone. Venus is here to do her press. If you have a question, if you can raise your hand, please. Do we have any questions on the match to start? Any questions, if you can raise your hand, please. Go ahead, Samuel. Samuel, do you have a question? You'll need to unmute yourself. Is it better now? Can you hear me? Yes, go ahead, please. Yeah. Uh, good afternoon, Venus. Uh, can you tell us uh, how do you feel after this uh, loss? I think if I'm if I'm not wrong, it's your fourth uh, straight loss in the first round here. What are what are you feeling now uh, about uh, uh, competition on clay? Is it uh, something becoming more and more difficult over the years? Oh yeah, I didn't know that. So um, yeah, I guess it happened. So moving on. Have any more questions? You can raise your hand if you have a question, please. Go ahead, Samuel. Do you have another question, Samuel? We can't hear you. You need to unmute yourself. So, sorry, I'm not very used to to teams. Um, if you assess your performance today, Venice, what went wrong? Do you think it's just uh, that she, she played better than you? You felt a bit uh, a bit tired. Uh, is it uh, something special that that could uh, that could come to mind to to help uh, yourself assess what happened? Yeah, she definitely played a better match. I think that's what happens, you know, normally when someone wins. And, uh, you know, never really found the middle of my game, you know, sometimes too big, sometimes not big enough. So um, it's, it's nice when you can find that middle part. Go ahead, Stephanie. And hi, Venus. I was going to ask you about what uh, what you think is going to happen when you play doubles with Coco Golf. What do you expect to happen? Are you playing backhand or forehand first thing? <laughs> I think you'll have to wait and see. Obviously, <laughs> <Not> uh, <there. laughs> um, you know. I think we're. You know, hopefully going to be um, a perfect match, and she's um, so extremely talented that I'll definitely be expecting her to do all the work. <laughs> did you ask her or did she ask you? Uh, I think the feeling was mutual. And okay. Welcome to our on their way to PC3. Go ahead, Samuel. Do you have a question? Uh, yes, Venus. Uh, you're one of the most experienced players on the tour. Um, uh, what was your reaction to what happened with uh, um, Naomi Osaka and uh, what she said about the, 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 the pressure of, uh, of uh, doing a, a post-match interviews? And I, I was wondering if you ever felt uh, compar if you had the comparable feelings in the past. How, 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 how did you cope with all the, the media? attention and the media duties throughout your career yeah it's not definitely not easy to do press and i think for for any person 
And uh, I don't remember the rest of the question. Sorry. So, so the rest of the question was, uh, how did you cope with it throughout your career? And if you sometimes felt uh, that it uh, that you had to, to do uh, unnecessary efforts? Uh, for me personally, how I quote, how I deal with it was that I know every single person asking me a question can't play as well as I can and never will. So no matter what you say or what you write, you'll never light a candle to me. So that's how I deal with it. Um, but each person deals with it differently. Any final questions? Okay, we're done. Thank you, Venus. Thank you.